Yo, what is up guys, it's Zed Kravos from video, and today, I am going to be ranking every tier 1 skin in Fortnite. So, the tier 1 skins are basically the skins that you get immediately in the beginning of the battle pass. Immediately when you're buying the battle pass, you will get two tier 1 skins, and I'm going to be ranking every single one of them. We have 14, and yeah, that's basically it, and let's get started. <laughs> Alright, so coming in in the number 14 spot, taking home the place for being the worst tier 1 skin in Fortnite, we have the Battlehawk. And in my opinion, this is not necessarily a bad skin, it's just very boring, like the colors are quite boring, the outfit is very simple and boring. And yeah, it's just nothing spe special, like it's not necessarily a bad skin, it's just very boring. But now moving on to the number 13 spot, we have Zenith. And in my opinion, this is just a very bad tier 1 skin. Like, I never really liked this one. I don't really know why I don't like it. Because it has a lot of, like, customizable styles. It has, I don't know how many styles, but it has a lot of them. And that's cool and everything. But I personally don't really like any of the styles for it. But it, at least it has a lot of styles, so that's good. But I'm ranking it, like, as an outfit. And personally, I don't like any of the styles, really. But that's just my opinion. Now moving on to the number 12 spot, we have Sentinel, and uh, this is just a uh, quite, uh, like, it's a very funny skin, like it's a robot chicken, and it's just uh, quite bulky, and it's not that good either, like, yeah, I don't really know why I don't like it, but in my opinion, all the ones above it are just better. But now coming in, in the number 11 spot, we have Mission Specialist. And uh, I think this is quite a cool skin. I pretty much like all the skins now about this one and above. But I just think this one is quite cool. I like the colors and everything. The orange. And I think it's a very nice thing. It has like an astronaut, an astronaut uh, like skin in Fortnite. I think that's very cool. But it's just not a great skin. But I still do think it's quite a good skin even though I have it very low. But now coming in in the number 10 spot we have Blue Squire and this is a very OG skin, this was actually the first ever tier 1 skin in Fortnite, it was back in season 2, this was the first one and I think this is a very underrated skin, like everybody just talks about the Black Knight and personally I think that, like the Blue Squires is as good as the Black Knight pretty much, in my opinion at least you guys probably disagree on that, but in my opinion it's almost as good as the Black Knight and it's a good skin but all the ones above it are just better and I think it's very cool with the knight and everything but we have a lot of knights now in Fortnite, but I still do think it's a very cool skin. But now coming in in the number 9 spot we have DJ Yonder. And uh, this is a very nice skin, it's just, it was a meme skin and it was a super super popular skin when it did come out. But now pretty much I've never seen anyone use it, but I still really do think it's a cool skin, it's a DJ Llama. And yeah, it's just a very cool and nice idea. But coming in in the number 8 spot, we have the Huntress. And this is a very underrated skin in my opinion. Like this is a very hated skin. But personally I really like it. Especially like with the wolf pack. I rocked that combo a decent amount of that much. But I still do think it's a very underrated skin. Even though I don't use it that much anymore. I think it's a very underrated skin. I think it looks clean and yeah it's very nice. But now coming in in the number 7 spot, we have the Blackheart. And this is quite a new skin and it has a lot of styles you guys might probably like put a bit higher But I do think it's a very cool skin. It has a lot a lot of styles But it's just not like it's anything very special like it has a lot of style There's like a pirate and like a skull pirate and everything so I really like that and It actually is quite unique, but in my opinion, it's just not that good to use It doesn't really feel good to use it and yeah, that's why it's in the number seven spot but now coming in in the number 6 spot we have Drift and uh, recently actually the Summer Drift did come out so like that was quite boring that that came out like as a skin but that shows how popular the Drift is and like the Drift is a really popular skin and I do think it's good but it's kind of a little bit overrated in my opinion even though I really like it I just feel like the 5 above it are better and in my opinion it's just a little bit overrated. But now coming in in the number 5 spot, I have the Hybrid. 
and I really like this one. I like the like pretty much all styles for it. They're just like the first like ninja style and then the last dragon style. I think it looks very very cool and I really like it like a dragon as a skin in Fortnite. I think this is a very very cool idea and it's a real cool skin. I really do think so but the four about are a little bit better in my opinion. And yeah let's go on to the number four spot. We have the carbide. And this is a super underrated skin. Like I don't know why like nobody loves this skin. I really don't know because like it's very similar to Omega. It's almost as good as the Omega. Like I truly do think so. It literally is pretty much the exact same skin as the Omega, but it has different colors. And like the Omega like, gets super much love, and this one gets quite a lot of hate. So that really does not make any sense in my opinion. Like it's almost as good as the Omega. It's almost identical, and uh, like. I am very confused by this. I really don't know why everybody hates this skin and loves the Omega. I'm quite confused by that, but I really do think this is a cool skin, especially like the first style of it is my favorite. And yeah, it's a very clean and simple and nice skin. But now we have the top three, and coming in in the number three spot, I have Calamity. And this is a very cool skin. I did not used to like this skin, like when it first came out, or not, not when it first came to the battle pass, but like a little bit after. I used it like always, like when it's a skin, new skin, you probably like it more. But after like one month, I really didn't like this skin. I don't know why, I just thought it was quite boring and quite bad. But now I've started to like it again, and I really like this skin now. I think it looks very clean, the red and black. And personally, I like the, the earlier stages of it more than when it has a big cape. But I still do think with the cape, it's a cool skin. But like the third or second stage of it, it's probably my favorite. But yeah, let's move on to the number two spot. I have the rocks. And uh, this this season's battle pass, season one, tier one. And uh, yeah, I think this is a very, very cool skin. It has so many customizable styles with the colors, with the armor. And yeah, this is just phenomenal tier 1 skin. I really do think so. If you guys saw my video ranking like every single, um, what's it called? Every single battle pass it, that like two weeks ago or so. My favorite battle pass was the season 9 because it just has so many good skins. And the rocks is definitely one of them. It's just such a nice skin. It really is. It's super clean and it's super nice. But now, coming in in the number one spot, taking home the place for being the best tier one skin in Fortnite. In fact, this is my favorite skin overall in Fortnite. And yeah, it's the Lynx. And yeah, this is just such a nice skin. Like, it really just is. In my opinion, it's the best skin in Fortnite, like, quite by far. Literally, it doesn't exist a number two spot, like, for being the best skin in Fortnite. In my opinion, I really just love the Lynx. I think it's such a good skin. It has a lot of different colors and different, like, with the suit and everything. And yeah, it's just such an awesome skin. But yeah, that's basically been it for today's video. If you enjoyed, be sure to drop a like. And also, guys, if you Want to support me and cop like some of the new Fourth of July skins? Be sure to use code ZRDEC in the item shop when you're doing it. I would really, really appreciate you. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye. Take care.